All right, for dinner tonight is lemon ricotta ravioli. Starting with the pasta dough, two cups of double zero flour, three eggs, some salt, some olive oil. I like to mix it beforehand, it's less messy. Ring's coming off. I'm gonna make a well. I have the rest here top. Yes. Okay. Yes. I'm just gonna put it in the well. Now I'm just gonna mix it. Almost there, all done. And know it's ready, just poke it, and it'll bounce back. I'm just gonna wrap it up and let it rest for at least 30 minutes. Next, I'm trying something new. I'm making these like basil pearl caviar balls. I got agar agar, it's $10 on Amazon. So I'm gonna fill this bowl up with some oil. I'm gonna put this in the freezer for at least 30 minutes. I'm gonna boil some water. Induction burners hurt my ears so bad. Right. I'm gonna boil the basil for a few seconds. And then I'm gonna take it out, put the basil in here with a little bit of water. I had it in the wrong blender. I'm just gonna strain it all out. Get all that juice. I'm saving this for the filling. Now another pan, in the basil liquid. I have a half a gram of the agar agar in here. I'm gonna put it in here, and then I'm supposed to cook it for one minute. I'm gonna add it in here, please don't explode. All right, moment of truth. Wait, is it working? Is it working? I don't know. I think it worked, I think it worked. Oh my gosh. And now we're gonna strain them. I'm gonna run them through water. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Are edible Orbeez. Okay. I have to try it first. It's a texture of an Orby. I feel like I shouldn't be eating it. That's so cool. Now I'm gonna make some ricotta cheese for the filling. Half a gallon of whole milk. I'm making garlic ricotta, so I'm gonna add some garlic powder to the milk. More flavor. I'm using juice of one lemon. I'm waiting for the milk to steam up right before it simmers. All right, I can tell it's about to simmer, so I'm gonna add my lemon juice. And it's gonna start curdling up within the next few seconds. I'm gonna let it sit for 10 minutes and let it really curdle up. Now I'm gonna strain everything. So I'm just gonna let this sit for 20 minutes, let it cool down and just dry out. I'm gonna make the filling. Add my ricotta cheese that sat. I'm gonna add this extra basil from the little basil orbies. A bunch of Parmesan cheese. Parmesan. Minced garlic going in here. Some lemon zest. Salt and pepper. Mix. Ravioli time. I'm gonna cut this in fours. I'm using my pasta attachment. You don't need this. You can roll it out. I'm gonna go through all these numbers on the dial twice. Starting at one. Eight. Next, I have this cool ravioli maker, but I'm not sure how to place it at the right angle. You fold your pasta sheet in half, crank it just a little bit, and you're gonna add your stuffing. Crank it, and it stuffs the ravioli as you go. I separated them, but off camera, because I was having a mental breakdown trying to separate them. Now I'm gonna salt my water like the ocean. I'm gonna add my ravioli. I'm gonna cook them till they start to float. Okay, they're done. Adding some butter. I'm adding some chili flakes too, just a little bit. Add some lemon juice. I'm gonna add my ravioli in here. Now it's on the plate. I'm gonna add some ricotta on top. Adding my basil orbeez. Lemon zest. Baby basil leaves. I don't know if I like it or not. This is it. I hate it. I don't like the way it looks, but maybe it tastes better. I don't know why I can't plate. Get some good lemon ravioli. Mm. It's good, I just hate the presentation.